Now, the Kaduna State Police Command has apprehended four persons over alleged child trafficking in the state. They were arrested at Samaru Zaria in Sabongari local government area of the state and brought to the police headquarters in Kaduna. Now, the state acting public relations officer, Mansoor Hassan, says the suspects were apprehended through intelligence gathering. The report. Okay. The arrested suspect okay. have been identified as Rahila okay. Gajere, a retired social worker, Ngozi Peter A. Nurse, Mariam Afaka, and Blasin Eze. During interrogation at the police command, Mariam confessed to supplying Ngozi with stolen children and receiving payment from her. She admitted to obtaining these babies from young girls with unwanted pregnancy. Mariam said she has supplied about three to four infants to Ngozi but doesn't know where the babies have been taken to. I want to say in Tana Bumu Abaya, Mubi, Zamu Tapi, Kota Bimu Mizamana Uku, Bawani Kadeza Tasaba, Mubi, the damn matter, Tana Zama Asha went to Amabazo, Ita Tasa and their matter. Yeah, we often go together uh, and we still have a child how we give her, and she takes back uh, and wants another child. Uh, I don't know where she takes the children to. She pays me 25 or 50,000 naira per child. The one is in Tavani Dubu Hamsung, one is in Tavani Dubu Isherin Dibia. Ngozi on her part denies stealing any babies, claiming that the two girls found in her house we are adopted. Okay. I adopted the two girls. How? Uh, one, the senior one was uh, 2017. How much have you paid? Uh, 350,000. You pay, you pay 350,000 naira to who? There's uh, one woman that has similar issue that I was introduced to through Mrs. Eze. How much do you buy the second one? 450,000. 450,000. Mm -hmm. How? To it, who? I am, who? I am a reproductive health provider. Mm -hmm. So it's a student that came to my shop and confided in me that she, she had a wanted pregnancy. She explained that she had met Mariam two years ago because she used to patronize her chemist. A healer, a retired social worker, and blessing. We are also implicated as members of the group. I asked her where did she got the child. She didn't tell me. She didn't tell you. Yes, then why do you issue her certificates? I am sorry, sir. As she... you know, born. Uh -huh. As you know, born. So uh -huh. uh -huh. I come direct to my church member. And okay. so the woman is late now. Mm. And both the husband, two of them, is late. Mm. It's late because they don't live Zaria. The command's public relations officer, ASP Mansur Hassan while advising all to be cautious of people around them, confirm that investigation is ongoing while the suspect will be charged to court once the investigation concludes. We always have this issue at the area. With this, that is where we draw the attention of the members of the public, especially who are given house for rent and other things. So they should be very, very careful. They further confess that they conceal their faces with veils when carrying out their activities to hide their identities. Bella Musa, Trust TV News Kaduna.